bitch, I'm a fighter. You're making noise in the streets. Hey, make us like a fire. Throwing hooks to a beat. I got my finger on my pulse, it's steady. I was built for the speed. I'm a fighter, You're making noise in the streets, hey, make us like a fire, throwing hooks to a beat, I got my finger on my pulse, it's steady, I was built for the speed, automatic shift gears, I'm ready, headstrong, I believe, when I close my eyes and count to ten.
So the gates are open, so we lace the bones. Don't hold me back no more, unleash the beast inside. Stand up with my pride, I was born to toe the line. I'm ready to light the fire inside.
Somewhere between heaven and the tall pine trees Hard land, I'm missing you Guitar playing through the night It feel pretty good and I'm feeling alright Good as one for the price of two
Welcome, 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 ladies and gentlemen. We are here tonight for Thomas College versus St. Mary's University. It's going to be the Terriers versus the Huskies here as we go on into Sunset. Tonight it's going to be a best of three series here hosted by yours voice truly, Saminami. And we're going to be seeing here what both sides have the offer. It's going to be Thomas College here starting on the defense wall. The Huskies here from St. Mary's will be on the attack. We'll be seeing a number of selections here. Right now they're hovering over what would be a mirror matchup here. And not odd to see these choices as well as it is part of the generic meta for this map. Being able to cover the angles, provide smokes, get recon, and initiate with blinds while also scouting your rear. It's all textbook in order to make your way throughout the site. One thing you have to be aware of is how you position yourself against one another. You're going to be see time runs out and the players are forced to lock in their picks. We're going to be starting here with a mirror matchup as mentioned here. I am proud to see that Cloud9 logo go in there for the side of Czar. So, look and see if they could bring that energy that they have of it. But, you also got to watch out for the essentials here from Bryce as well. Both sides are ready to cook. Locked and loaded. They're making their way through. Let's take a look at this map, shall we? This is going to be an interesting map overall here. I mean, take a look at this. You have a huge courtyard to work with. But then, over on the attacker side, you have these hallways that you have to make your way through. While defenders are able to easily hold sites like A around these corners without much trouble whatsoever. So with that being said, we are going to be seeing setups here from either side playing a very split push here to start the round. Let's see how this unwinds going on into it. Let's take it from the eyes here of Jupiter. Gonna initiate here with a paint nade going on out. Beautiful spot to land as well. Deals the damage as needed here. Amelius is going to start making his way on in themselves with rays to support. Guru Town now gonna be taking this orb and starting their frontal push here. But they're not really too confident on making that until they get a bit more intel. They want to be sure to clear out any sort of corner so they don't have to deal with trouble. Keep an eye here on Emmy. Emmy's going to be looking for a shot here, but you better watch out for Spammy because Spammy could catch him right back as soon as you make the swing. The blind goes on out there, which means no defender is going to be able to look from that angle. And they realize that there's no one going to be flanking them either. They're ready for some actions if they're going to see it. Found them. They did get the spot with the recon bolt there, so that's going to let them know where they're going. A second one is going to be taken here as Emmy makes the trade out through mid and courtyard here. And now they're going to start making their way towards the site. <coughs> Keep a look at Mars here. He's actually sitting around in the left. smoke. A very dangerous spot to be, but an effective one nonetheless. Completely clearing it out there. Could get Mars. Deals a bit of damage, but thankfully you, you don't get planted. to hear someone getting hurt when you're on the opposing side. Now it's going to be a full frontal push here. Having a couple of shots come on out. It's going to be dull falling, double blind, and moving in. Gets traded back by Mars, and now you got to get a bit aggressive here. Going in with the blind, you got to be looking this breach, making some headway for the point here. You got to make a cover here as there's going to be a swing for this defusal. Look at Emmy. Emmy could get the shot, but misses it as needed. And this fight is going to get defused with a full team elimination. Have a bit of a uh, call out here from the chat. Dolensheimer? Seems like a play on Oppenheimer for Dole. Not sure what that's really supposed to mean, but who cares? We're here for some games, aren't we? If I could, I would get th some predictions going for you guys, but I am not in control on that yet. Regardless, here we see from the defenders, they're going to be setting up with very heavy buys. 
A bulldog in hand as well. Gonna be another setup here from Jupiter. Nade goes on out once again. A great spot to hold out the choke here. Now gonna be making their way up. They're looking to see if they can take as many orbs as possible. Probably going for a strategy of just getting the showstopper here. But that's not going to be as effective, especially when you do the same thing as last. You're going to get punished for it going on in. Shock there just misses its point there from the side of Amelia's. And now here comes the swing. Going to be trying to get some shots and not going to be able to find what they're looking for. Got to watch out for the concussion. Hits the side. And Jupiter is able to make that trade. They're not going to be making their way on over here. You got to watch out for mid control here. Mars is going to be the one to encounter counter them looking the, at them through smoke just misses Not them ready. by a hair of a chance standing ahead oh that gives oh, away your uh. position i don't think he saw the gun as it swings back around now it's going to be even up here three to three it's all about rotation 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 we're about to see an engagement here between dole and mameras Mara is going to be coming around with the swing here but i don't think they're ready for dole with the bulldog on hand it's and done. One enemy That's remaining. gonna be Heal. the last Spike one there with a. Emmy. Last alive. Left. Emmy has to hit this right click carefully, yes. but unfortunately he puts his crosshair a little too down to the corner. Where will they go this time? None may know, Emmy. As we're gonna be seeing here, Thomas College is up by two, and they're gonna still be working with lighter buys. They're not gonna be committing fully. We do get to see some stingers here. I'm real excited for this selection. Curious to see if there is a stinger because it looks a little different from what I'm used to seeing. Maybe they just updated the gun style. Who knows? Nonetheless, we're gonna be going right on into this match. I'm going to lead the charge here. It's going to be Amelius with Hunter's Fury on deck. But they do I'm have the drawn. spike. They need to start making their way over two points in order to make Enemy sure attack. that they can I start to get something going. Dole has been spotted and is in a world of hurt here. But manages manages to scamper away. That was a big pass up, unfortunately, from the side of the huskies there they really need to get that plan as needed concussive blast there it's going to help zone them on out take a look at the shock dart here just missing its mark now bryce going to be making their way on in with the cell of mars here but watch out from this push coming in through the smoke here as soon as it rips they're going to be playing aggressively the into area. this here here we go now the smoke goes on up and there's no one to be seen but watch yourself mars is going to be lurking around with breach as well jupiter able to not get the trade off as needed there the stinger does not hit all bullets as Spike it should planted. it's truly unfortunate for the side of the terriers here but you got to work with what you got here So, gonna be looking to see our way in there. It's gonna be here. a 5v2, two stingers spotted, but that's not really gonna help with a trade up from the Bulldog here. Last Almost gets a swing, but Amelius is quicker on the draw. Now it's gonna be spammy looking for some exit picks here. Trying to see if they can find anyone coming around the side. The one that will be getting some action here going in is going to be spammy, taking some a bit of damage. And I think they're just purposely pushing the point in order to do a full reset. If they can, they're going for some exit picks, but not going to be able to get any. I, feel like myself. I do uh, like the That's response the there from you, Ermit. <laughs> Responding to what I was saying earlier. Uh, Lewis, that's going to be that first round win for the side of the Huskies here. They were able to pull one on back, and now things are going to be even up in terms of guns. Now, you do see that the defense here from Thomas College, they're playing a bit with fire. They only have two with full armor and three with light. It's not really great going into this fight here. You have to really make sure you hit your shots then going Shadows into this. Traveling. Better be making a push up around the side. Dole is trying to play it safe as they are alone. Taking a look at this angle from Jupiter, who's constantly corner peeking, but finding no action. Turn back over to Dole. Dole could see a swing here, especially from Amelius, who's going to be starting to help make the push up. <coughs> right here. But it seems like they're Caution just here. trying to make a lot of I have noise. The spikes before rotating back every single time almost had the spot there that's going to cost you as marmara's had the guns ready so now the defenders here are in a bit of a bind 
as they're not really going to be able to make the trade-offs they were hoping for. Not right away, at least. Come around the side here, get ready for some action. Stun does come out and their location is revealed. Bryce needs to just let her rip. Does a bit of damage, but not enough that's going to be significant. A lot of noise going around here, and you're going to be looking at this drone coming around the side. Cannot get out of the way in time, and things are not looking good. It's going to be fast engagement, but that spike carrier down. Spike That'll down delay the a. plant for just a mere matter of moments. That's the next. Looking for a third. Oh, just missing by a turn. But uh, spots him, standing. but cannot get the trigger pulled in time. Man on him and full shields. Let's see if they can do something with it. Spammy is blocked off by smokes on one side. And from the other, you got to look at Emmy. Emmy has this perfect setup of the crosshair, but is going to come down to pure luck on this swing. Swing comes on out, and he gets spotted first. Now you have to get the aim going, but you're already stunned, so you're thinking, what's the point? It's already gone. Let's try to reset and go for the next one. Things are now evened up here, folks, and the alt economy is in favor of the Huskies. Take a look at them. They got two ultimates ready to go on deck with a third in the hole. As for the side of the defense, they got one on deck, but two in the hole. And they're playing with very light buys. You're going to have to see yeah. something strange coming out here from the side of the Terriers. In this dog-eat-dog -dog world, they're going to have to get real, real aggressive. That's going to be a blind going on through. Doesn't hit anybody whatsoever. With the tripwire set on up, now they're going to feel very comfortable pushing on to the side. The goal is playing very back. Now we're hearing the showstopper. Ready, ready, ready. They just spotted him. Has to wrap around the corner for a shot. Random going. And it hurts Dole a lot. Dole has taken a significant amount of damage as Mars has out. fallen. Now you're going to have to work with this big iron on your hip. Making the swing your cage has been triggered. And it does not stop the bullets here as you would have wanted with Harbor at least. That's going to be costing you. That's one life is going to be Bryce. Bryce has to play it very smart on this engagement. You're getting shot at by all sides. And a flawless round going over to the Huskies. St. Mary's is really looking strong here. So based on what we are seeing here, I would say strategy-wise, for I would say yes, this do. for the Terriers here, they need to start working a bit more aggressive angles. They're, they're uh, especially with A site, they're giving up way too much space. B site has yet to be pushed completely here, and with the wraparounds, I think it could go to anyone's favor here. Spike is going to stay down on the ground as they're going to go for another poke out here. Going to be a first stun and another placement for the nade. Jupiter is going to be making the swing but does not get caught out for any oh, looking damage. Roomba is making its way on through, scanning for some dirt. Dirt found, but destroyed. Cannot complete objective. Truly unfortunate. Sad Roombas all around. Blind goes on down there, making the swing. Able to get the pure trade up there. Now concussive blast with Satchel. And things are going to be traded even one for one on either side. Spike now taken. And since you're down your silver, you're not going to get any sort of I know exactly except where you are. from the cipher here. The Nero uplink has given away the position of everybody. And you're looking for this teleport here. Especially coming around the rear. Maris does not get out in time. Does spot Mars, but he could have lost his Come life there now. if Mars committed to the push. Going right, to be looking yeah. for a setup here. One, two, three, looking to get on I in. Hunter's Fury has been activated. Watch your teammates, because you can hurt them a great deal. And this next one just misses Mamares. Now coming around the side, Mamares able to get onto the high ground here, but stay it safe. That's not good. Your position has been given away, and now you're about to get rid of one bullets. Making the swing here is going to be Zara. Zara's going to have to get Mar. Mar does fall, but does only after a certain one amount of time. And it's going to be a trade here. 1v1. Who's going to get a swing and a hit? Bryce is able to clutch it on up here for the side of the Terriers. That puts the score 3-3. Three to three. Now, I do want to say this early on. I do appreciate you all coming on out here. I feel like Valorant, for every time I'm casting this game, is just the most popular out of all the platforms, Overwatch and Rocket League included. Now, if we could get viewers from oh, both of those, nice oh, spot. wouldn't that be fun? Nonetheless, you probably won't get to see my face till much later. 
Okay, so that back to the match here. You are going to be seeing, despite the win, it was a costly one. The defense has to play with light bias here, and they're looking to play it very thrifty. Look at this stack up here going on over towards A site. They're going to be aggressive pushing on in. And he's going to be lurking around through the cart yard here. Does get spotted. That's not what you want to have happen. Now going to be making the swing here, looking for a shot set up. Excuse me, having a bit of the hiccups here. Because this is going slow. What I thought was about to head fast and brisk was just stereotypical waiting. They're trying to see if they can out mine. They're trying to play mind games with everyone. That's really all it is. Though here, going to be looking for the scout. If he keeps his camera up, could mark. But he has to keep his eye on the left there. He's just constantly trying to keep a swing. Take a look at Mars here. Mars is about to catch some action here with Mirrors and Emmy. Here's the shots, and that's going to be Bryce going on down. You want to have a Frenzy in handy. You have to hit every single headshot on the swing here, especially as you get hit like this. That recon does give away their position, but you got to be careful with the cage Spike now. Planted. Spike's been planted, and you're in a very terrible setup for the side of the fence. I mean, smokes are out, and you're trying to make your swings on the point. Good. Good freaking luck. Now gonna be coming their way on through here. Take a look at Dole. Dole's gonna be in a world of hurt as soon as the smoke drops in three, two, one. That's gonna be the first job. And now they've been spotted. Dole's been hit as well. And that's gonna be constant here. That's two down. Looking for Spammy. Spammy's gone with the third. Amelius able to shut down Mars from getting any sort of chance on redemption. Overall, this is a very, very close match and we're gonna have a timeout called here by the side of the terrier shadow band once they get a breather now you have a minute to win it here folks and with full buys as well from either side what's the strategy going in here you might be asking well i know it's not very popular and this is my personal kind of strategy i would go into this right don't use any sort of stingers and you don't have anything like walls or slows right well let's play like this if you're gonna sit down smokes Play in the smoke with a judge. Just get real scummy with it. You want to try to play close quarters against this team who does not like to do that. They like to play very distant and afar so they don't get caught out from the off angles here. And it really does all come down to mechanical skill in these types of situations here. When you're either from pushing or trying to recover a site, it's all about the mental and knowing where people position. Being able to just hear a single footstep can be a game changer from a win or a loss per round. Well, without further ado, enough rambling from me. You're here to see the game. Let's see these buys. Full buy is going to be coming on out here, and the economy is looking beautiful in terms of alts for the defensive. They might be going around with Omens alt here, and just forgive me, but I need to see it again from the shadows. Never, don't play them enough, so I cannot ever remember that all day. Regardless, you're going to be seeing the smoke set on up, as you see here, marked on the map. And now it's going. Having a bit of an initial blind there has to go in fast. And they're going to see if they can get an entrance pick here. They may commit to the point as well. Not going to be able to get any recon out of that dart, but they're going to try to maintain their positioning here. Looking for a double cross up fire. Mamiras gets punished from the angle by Bryce. They're now going to be trying to return the favor. It's going to be Zara and Amelius. Amelius going in for the scouting drone. The owl is surveying and surrounding. Does hit its mark. That's going to be one of them. And it gives away the position. That's not good. Omens down and Jupiter's almost fallen. Following through with that, that could have been disastrous. Now making the swing over here is going to be Bryce. Bryce is going to have to try to play with a blind, but Emmy does get the trade onto Dole. Now, they did it before, and they're going to do it again. Run, run, run. You know you got to make your way to a site here. Now going to be coming around the side. We're going to be seeing Mars having to push up aggressively here. And he has all abilities available, but needs to watch the swing here. Finds him, but is missing the spray initially. They do get the trade in the end, but Zar is able to... Put it on back. It's left. a 3v2 here, but make that more a 3v1. Jupiter is either going to have to be a meat shield or whatnot. We're now going in with the Rolling Thunder here from Bryce. Looking feet. for some action. Rolling Thunder hits twice here, but it does not hit anyone from the side. The Fender Zara is now going to be coming on out with the Concussion Blast as well. They're trying to just stall Five out this point. Hits one the first, gets remaining. the second. Now going to be looking for the third. Emmy's going to be the last one alive here. Flash goes on out. Does not hit. Gets remaining. the swing onto the chest. Going to be playing it safe here. Gets the stun. And that stun is not going to be enough. As Emmy just plays it safe with a one, two, three tap to the chest. 
When in though, Here. double tap. Even so, triple tap. You're never gonna have them come up again from that. That was clean by that Emmy there. there. And that's exactly what I like to see when you get stunned by someone like Breach. Yes, you may be a bit disoriented, but bullets hit their marks. They do a lot of damage. So if you're consistent and you stay calm, you're gonna outgun them. Here. Hands down, anytime, anywhere. Second look at our weaponry here. It's gonna be full saves here from the defense, as you can see, with full buys on the side of the attack. They didn't really lose too many themselves, and that's gonna be Cougar able to get double the value and moving their way towards B site here. If they so choose, they're just trying to get the scouting out as needed. The Roomba finds no dirt on the field. So it was a very good Roomba. They're able to do its job very nicely. Gonna be looking to see if they can get any sort of scouting capabilities, but none to be found here. Tune back in over here to Spammy Spammy. Just waiting for it. Crikey, it's gonna be coming right around the corner here. Cougars gotta be very careful, otherwise they're gonna be the prey of this hunt. Either side is just going to be dancing around the side. You can see their legs are jiggling. But here's the action. Just spots Emmy. Emmy has no idea if they've been seen. But <laughs> there was a crucial mistake there from the side of Thomas That's College. Swing and a hit. Now it's down to Dole. Dole, what do you do? You get some initial shots on to Emmy there. That's great. You dealt the damage. Now can you get the kill? You can especially Spike go planted. for a save here from your economy. That's going to be perfect, but Emmy, I think, has their mark. I stand corrected here. Not going to be making a swing. Zara saves the day. Now, ladies and gents, you have seen these past three rounds have not been great for the Terriers. If you're a fan of Thomas College, you're probably thinking to yourself, what do these guys need to do? Well... I think you were seeing Thomas College get a bit aggressive there, pushing from the rear, but it wasn't the worst. I mean, especially going into the save round, your best bet is actually to stall and pick them off ambush style, not be rushing in aggressively like you saw Jupiter and Bryce do, getting picked off immediately by Cougar. Oh, and then once again, Cougar is hungry for some damage, and instead does not see they're walking into their own demise. Oh, that's gotta hurt. Now gonna be looking for the swing here. His family has an opportunity onto Emmy, but Emmy could trade it on back. Not gonna be seeing any action, however, for now. Just going to be going with the owl. Not able to find anyone. Tried its best, but its best was not good enough. You're seeing a waiting game. Looking to see t the Terriers get a bit antsy Cover with their up. positioning. They're just gonna take their time here. Yes, they're on the attack, but they feel good. They don't feel pressured by the defense to have to do something. Oh, Spammy gets spotted there. Just able to escape that initial rush from the barrage. Now we're gonna be looking for that recon. Recon does hit. And now we're looking in from the raise. Jupiter able to find one. In the second, look at the third. Not able to get that third, but gonna help trade up from Zar. Zar is now gonna be able to get two at least. And looking hungry for more, exactly more. Picking up the Phantom and Neural up it has been activated there. Though has been spotted. And now they're gonna have to make their rotation. It makes it once, it does it twice. Now you're going to get on the point again. 30 seconds Blind left. goes in immediately here, looking for the scout, but not going to be able to find anything. Swinging, swinging, swinging as they do, but the defense is staying very far back. Why? Dole is scared, and understandably so. There goes the trip bar. Now it's a no. Hey, we got to be safe. Sun comes on out, and they do get the spike planted. Left. Uh -oh, Shaggy. Spammy's coming around the corner here like a true ghoul from the night. Zara's gonna have to watch his angle here. Let's see if he can win it on out. Spammy is actually gonna sit Last back carefully standing. and has to get him. Does find it! Two health in a dream here. Just trying to put down the bullets, but he does it a little too early. Unfortunate for him as this one's going over to the Terriers. The Huskies are loud and they are proud. You have to give them props. They already have six rounds on the board here, so they've done their job minimum for the first half. Now they're trying to see how many more they can get away with before the sides swap. Let's see what it comes out to be here. Full buy is going to be coming out from either side yet again here, but the defense is still strapped for their economy. It's not looking too great, I'm going to be honest, but you still have a grand opportunity here to bring it on home. 
I'm gonna be trying to see this engagement here. I think it's gonna be a full frontal assault onto A site. Let's see what happens. Going, going, going. That's gonna be the initial stun with the nade just missing. Now gonna be making the swing on the side here from Bryce and Jupiter. Five, one, two, looking for the three. Watch out, Roomba. Here comes the scene. Now it is two down from the side of the attackers with some damage dealt back to the defense, but not enough where it counts. Your mark, Amelius has to retreat because they do not want to be caught out into the open here. The Terriers are a very slow style play, playing team, and it's not the worst, but especially something where you have to be ready at any corner for some action. I'll be looking for the second. Dole almost loses his head. It was a mere hair of a miss. Looking for some scouting capability here. Now going to be moving in with Mamera's, but the spike is still with Amelia's. Going to have to try to see if they can catch out Jupiter. Jupiter now going to be spotted here, but does not get marked, so they're just maintaining the space. Coming around for the spike, that's going to spot you, and finally get the punish there, but it almost went awry. 30 seconds left. Now gonna be looking for the set of their spots, Amelius, but Mars does not get taken down. Takes a little bit of a scare, but not enough to really push them back. That's gonna be the shock dart there. Now they're making their way over through to the market here as they try to get towards B site. Looking for some concussion blasts. It's just a big miss. Left. As Bryce is gonna be going for a stun and blind. Sees him and trying One to get the swing. Able to get the spike carrier down. Spike it's three seconds down, remaining B. unless they can plant it right here. And now it's all for naught. Spots Jupiter. Can they get the trade? No siree. Emmy's playing the live. Last round before the switch. Ladies and gentlemen. If you haven't heard from me before, you're going to hear it from me now. If you have alts, if you have abilities, if you have guns, if you yes, have anything you left in the bank, you better invest it because you're not going to oh, have it this is a nice spot. going into the side swap. Right now, the Terriers have not only brought it back from being down from these consistent r round wins. I'm losing my voice. But they're there. almost going to even out the sides. What you need to see here from the Huskies is some initiation to help take back control. You have been marked. Emmy is now in a bit of trouble, so they need to reposition themselves so they do not get caught out. That's going to be the door through the cafe there, taken away first. And watch out, the showstopper coming on in. Looking for anyone. Cougar tries to get it marked, but does not find any. It's now for the first and last time a plant onto B site from the Huskies here. Surprising, is it not? They were able to flip the script and change things up. Now you're going to have to look for this engagement here as it goes fast and furious. Cougars are able to get one as well as Mamera's. They do trade one on back as there's going to be a big amount of damage coming out against Jupiter there with that pain date. Watch out for the recon. Recon's going to scare you off. In this 3v2, you get marked and things aren't looking good. Especially with Amelia's having been able to scout you on out. Looking for the last one. Bryce is down. That's going to even up that Switching over sides. there as the Huskies were able to bring at least one more bonus round for themselves before the side swap. As I mentioned before, they did their job and they get rewarded with one more round. Right here. Now they're in the lead here. by two and typically when you're playing the defense, this map may not be as defensively sided. But B site definitely is. A site, as we're seeing, is having a little bit of a rougher time here for the side of the Huskies. Right but there. the Terriers are now on the hunt. And they're looking to see what kind of game they can find. We'll have to see how this goes here going on in through mid. You're seeing a heavy, heavy stack up through mid here. Curious to see what this pistol round is going to go Shadows like. Traveling. Immediate smoke's going to be happening here, and now as you see Jupiter immediately take control, that's going to be the stun on through as well, with no one to be found. Immediately, Mamera's does not want to be that close. Taking a swing here is going to be Cougar Town. Cougar Town now going to be probably making a push after this recon. They could try to hold if they wish to, but it's going to be one that they're seeing for. Now making the swing here themselves, just missing the shots as well. Going back over to Cougar Town. Cougar Town able to get some initial damage, but it's a swing from everywhere. 
The attackers have swarmed them from behind, and it was too late before they even knew it. The mirror is now going for a peek. Does spot Jupiter Shadow's as well time. as Dole. Going to be making us another swing here in three, two, one. Here we go. Dole is able to take the initiative, and now it's up to Jupiter to try to find something of it. Emmy's coming on through the smoke here, and they're just missing their shots as needed. Able to make that trade, and last one up is Zar. Zar is going to have to face it off against Bryce in this one v one here. Let's see if they can catch him on out. They're going around for right quick. McGee's here. Has to watch your back. Oh, it's going to come down to this old left. Western shootout. They spots him! And with the spike plan for another reward of 300 extra credits there. Right there. They come out to an even 4k here for the right side there. of Bryce Guns alone. That is a great startup here for the side of the Terriers to have going into the second half here. It seems that the defenders kind of got a bit scared and just pushed back out position completely. In fact, even if they want Strata Force by it, it is not recommended. I mean, look at this economy. They have, majority of them are par under... 2k so it's not looking real nice not gonna be moving in fast and furious here jupiter trying to find some action mamir is able to get a double but only able to trade it back by two themselves Paynade misses any sort of action here not gonna be really finding anyone and no one coming in through a site here now making the swing from behind there you now have some great action coming on out of spots cougar does not get the finishing kill as spammy needs to get back as well as mars mars has the spike here it does have a lot of health you have to be careful, especially when Mamera is, is just waiting there in the smoke. Oh, things could have been dark and dangerous there. But the footsteps tell him that, hey, they're rotating. Going to be Cover able to pick up out. that specter there, which gives them a gun in hand that you did not want to give up there. Might come across this tripwire. It does spot it and get rid of it. That lets them know they're Spike being planted. flanked. Now gonna be going for an aggressive push up here. Cougar could face Dole right around this corner. Dole's not ready for it whatsoever. There it is! Enemy remaining. They react hey. all the same. Able to pick up that bulldog from the others there. Things were not looking too well for themselves. Now making the swing, spots Cougar, one enemy gets remaining. the one, and now it's Standing up ahead. to the other. It's really down to whoever gets a quicker shot here. Oh, you gave away your position there. They weren't defusing it, but you're trying to make sure that they couldn't. And with the bait out, this one's going Thrifty. to the Huskies. All I need is spare parts. Spare parts? A mind with explosives? What more could you ask for? Maybe an Australian accent. Aye. Nonetheless, here, you do see that round goes to the Huskies. Now back this up by here. two once again here. Taking a look at this economy here. No one has alts for either side. And it's going to be the attackers here from the side of the Terriers that Thomas College has oh, to fight, try nice to play with their saves. So they got to start building yes, up their stocks and bonds here that they do in order to try to make a proper investment. Now going to be looking for this initial push up here. Let's take it from the eyes of Emilius, who does throw out this bolt here. It... Hits its mark, but finds no one, as you can see. A lot of blinds going on out, but no real action to be had. Now going to be aggressively pushed around the corner. Finds the first one for the second. Able to get it. That's by Carrier on now. Now going to be following it on up. They get taken out by Jupiter through a misplaced satchel charge. That's gotta hurt. But Spammy feels it the worst, especially losing it to the paint aid. Now it's going to be the blinding there as Bryce and Dole make their escape. Swift and accurate. Dole here with a big iron, has to run around the side, able to reclaim his camera. Now they're going to have some intel going into this point here, but least it be known here, the one that's on the lookout is Emmy, and they can hear some Case action. Now it's going to be a call here, one going for the point, remaining. spots the spike carry, and spike it's up to Bryce. B. Bryce in this 1v4 does not have a chance, unfortunately, and this one goes to the Huskies. St. Mary's has really just been kind of just showing up. As soon as it gets the full buys, unless you really kind of outplay them with their mind games, much less mechanically, they really are showing tough against the Terriers here. So you got to really try to play it a bit more mindful. You're seeing that Tom's College is playing it fast into a number of these rounds they're trying to rush these pushes but that might not be the case you're playing on the attack you might have to play it slow like you saw saint mary's do before that's going to spot jupiter there and the damage is already dealt that's going to be your first down your entry fragger out of commission 
not what you want to have going into these fights. If you can make a trade back, that's going to be great, but it also depends on who you get the trade against. Especially coming out here, as Dole has the spike in hand, but it's playing out very aggressively in the open, which is not recommended. Now going to be slowing, making their push up here just with 10 seconds plus a minute here. Going to be trying to see if they can scout anybody around. They should have seen, they should have seen Cougar Town right there just with the jump around. Shock Dart goes out but finds no one as the smoke is well placed there by Mameras. You're seeing a lot of waiting around here and personally I think they just need to start going towards A site instead of B. Yes, there's a lot of utility on A, but if you recall how the Huskies were doing it themselves, they actually were pushing through despite the tripwires, setting up smokes and blinds, and getting on point before rotating back around. It's all left. tactical here going into this. Mera's going in for another blind, but Shadows nothing traveling. to be found here as the full rotation now does come out to a site. They do get the mark there from the camera and Dole. Camera is down, so now you're seeing that Emmy is dealing with some Cost stall one. conditions. Yeah, Finds no. one with the tripwire, able to shut him down. That's the spike left. carrier of another going on through. Showstopper hits, it's Mark dead on with the pain nade also there, trying to go for a swing and a miss, but they did their job, they were able to stop any sort of plant, and despite the save here, that's a round over to the Huskies. The Terriers are probably feeling a bit frustrated here, they're trying to think what they can do, but Maybe they're feeling a bit nervous. Maybe they just don't want to try to push as hard as you saw the Huskies do on the attack. Who can say, really? But the best thing they can do here is keep their mental fortitude together. As you gotta make sure you don't give in to your opponents and let them bend you to their will. Gonna be looking for some recon. They do spot the first there and get spotted by the recon boat. Has to move now so they don't get shot out themselves. Now all tripwires and everything has been set up going towards B site this time around. But they're playing it very slow yet again. A lot of noise coming in through the cafe there but no one to be spotted quite yet. That's gonna be camera, uh, Cage camera down with camera up. Now they're going for a real Quiet fast push. Looking Cage for the swing around here by Joel. Gonna be trying to make his Cage way trigger. through. These cages here does get through in time, but Amy is making great work on point with this throw up. Point. Just missing those headshots, finds the first, almost gets second, but gets traded back there by Bryce. Bryce is now going to be the last one alive here, going to be making the swing. Recon comes on out as well as the nade, gets swung from behind as well as the pain nade. There's nothing else they could have done there. This one's going over to the Huskies once more. And that puts the score at 6 to 11. Only two more rounds that the Huskies have to take here before they get map number one. 6 to 11. As mentioned, full buy is going to be coming out from either side, but not full armor. You are going to be seeing Bryce find it light themselves. Hopefully, that's what you need. Bryce is also opting for the here. Phantom. It has a higher rate of fire with the trade up for damage here just by a smidget. So does it pay off? I'm not too sure myself, that as it's all gonna be coming down to their technical gameplay this time around. As you're going to have to try to work your positioning here. I mean, it's going for some scouting, but no one to be found. They do spot the rumor there to start as the cafe doors get blown off the hinges once more. You are gonna be seeing the terriers here not being deterred, in fact, they keep a beautiful shock dart as I well as an exactly elimination there. Are. Now it's going to be Dole. Dole has to be careful with Nero Uplink as he gets taken down himself. Right they do spot the defenders thanks to Nero Uplink once and twice. Going to be starting to make their rotation on through. I mean, now going to be making the swing here, but not going to be able to find anything as the smoke has been placed. Just mere seconds away. Ramirez looking for some action. Concussion finds no one in the blind. Goes to Pegnade. He's in a good spot, but here coming from the spot, it's going to be Hunter Spirit. Hits the elimination there and looking for another. Unfortunately, does some damage to Zar. Zar is not liking that too much, as you're going to be losing some health from that. Now going in with the rolling thunder here. But no one to be spotted. Makes a swing from behind. Mars finds one. Jupiter finds the next. And now it's up to the defenders to get something going. Gets the pickoff there. And one more from behind from Bryce. 
Unfortunately, that Rolling Thunder is not going to be able to find anyone, but it was a good idea trying to make sure you get full control of the point. Nonetheless, here, now we're going to be seeing that the defenders starting to lose a bit of that economy. It's going to start impacting here, especially when they have to buy for one another. But remember, they only need two rounds, and as soon as they get those, they're in the bank. So will we see the Terriers push the same angle, or will they try something different? Let's find out here. Gonna be coming around the side with the op in hand is Cooper Town. There. I'm not sure this is best utilization of economy here for an op. Yes, it's one shot, one kill, but you're really betting on getting a hit here. Ah, uh, but you may just find it as Dole's gonna start to get a little antsy. And so lucky that should not have been a life he gets a no second chance run. at life to try again hitting the marks first just missing cougar town has to get the third mark through pot only dealt half damage there cougar gets out with their own luck they are going to be seeing Sancho take care of any sorts of tripwire that was in place there. Just missing the headshots, but Mimeras was able to get the first. Now looking to get the silver there. Mars has to be very careful. Blind goes out and forces spike them planted. back down. Now the spike has been planted here. We're going to be seeing an aggressive push-up, probably from Jupiter and the rest. Paint Nade's able to hold the choke for now, but how long will that be? Blind comes on out and he has to be very good to switch on the swing at the side back, but it's already standing. dialed in out here. Now gonna be looking for Mars. Mars gets a second chance there, but Cougar able to finish it up despite the initial shot missed again. I think Cougar's being a little bit too trigger happy here with the off as it's just you have to play it very smooth, very relaxed when you're going for Match these, point. as you need to secure the kill, not just think that you get it automatically because you have one of the most powerful weapons in the game. Now, going into match point here, the Huskies just need one, and they're done! They're going to be able to take Sunset if they can win this round. But for the Terriers, they're going to have to fight with everything they got on the line. This means no saving and full investment. Let's see what they're going to be working with here. Shadow's going to be sent on up to make sure that no one gets taken out to start. With paint nade potential going on through, Mars gets taken out on lurking through the long to main of Cordyard there. Now the rotation's gonna be coming heavily on through here towards A site. And Cougar Town's not afraid at all. Those gonna get a bit scared off there as the spike gets planted. Spike planted. Now gonna be looking at the swing here from the blind. Blind hits beautifully. Concussion is next. They're trying to get the damage though. You're jumping around a little Last too sporadically. Gets that headshot, but gets traded back themselves. Ladies and gentlemen, the Huskies win map number one. Bit of a celebration there Shame. off the defuse of their defenders just as about to hit. We're gonna be hitting a quick intermission here, folks. Don't go anywhere, we'll be right back. Tell me, do you want to hear the story unfold? Cause I might turn out to be the villain, you know. Dark Knight King just dripping in gold. Living my life like I got a cheat code. Welcome to my world, next episode. Sequel to the trilogy story I chose. I'm taking down the empire, that's my throne. I won't ever quit, no. I'm back in the fight. Won't stop believing.
of a higher soldier of fortune. Gotta walk through the fire for what's important. And the warriors blown through your veins is coursing. Kill of a higher soldier of fortune. The whole world's watching every move. Take your shot, don't let the fool. All you got and all you one bullet in the chamber Real easy, take your aim, boy Ain't nobody gonna save you So what you gonna do? Oh, one bullet in the chamber Real easy, take your aim, boy Ain't nobody gonna save you So what you gonna do? Oh, one Do or die, you're a mercenary of a kind that you're burning to carry Go and make them proud that was necessary Oh no To our die, you're a mercenary Now the whole world's watching every move Take your shot, don't act the fool All you got and all you ever need Is one bullet in the chamber Breathe easy, take your aim Welcome on back, everybody. We did a little bit of a uh, an interesting thing here while you all were waiting. I'm joined here by Aiden from the side of St. Mary's. How you doing, Aiden? I was muted. Sorry, I'm great. Uh, how are you doing? <laughs> I'm doing all right. Glad to have you here. 
Now we are going to be starting here in this agent selection. I'm expecting a mirror matchup. What about you? Uh, in terms of, uh, are you talking in terms of agent comp selection. or in terms of, of how the game goes? Okay, agent selection. Yeah. Um, it looks like basically similar. I mean, you're seeing you're seeing the same roles being played by uh, each team. I mean, you see Cougar Town on Frag. That's always how Smooth Smooth plays. He's their Fragger. Yusuf flashes makes sense. Uh, Emmy playing between Cipher and uh, Killjoy. Killjoy on a sense Cipher on the last map, and then Smokes <laughs> always coming from Memraz and Emil always Sova. I don't think I've ever seen this guy not play Sova. Are you serious? Um, no, he probably has. He definitely does, but like in the comp games, he oh, yeah, he's yeah. the IGL, so he plays he plays Sova a lot. Okay. Seems to work. I mean, are you from Thomas College? I'm not, believe it or not. I'm from Stevenson University. I'm their uh, volunteer caster, Overwatch coach, now trying to get paid full time. But that's all besides oh, nice. the point. Yeah, I yeah, just that's do fair. this for fun, and I get uh, money from donations that I can send back to schools and other charities. Oh, that's cool. Yep. Tech. What do they mean, tech? Oh, tech fingers crossed. It's not a pause. Tech that's usually f asking for technical pause on the clock there, but do they actually do it? There it is. Yeah, they do. Okay. That's, uh, yeah, they're, so they're playing, uh, the St. Mary's team is playing from their, uh, the arena that the school built there, and it's great, really nice computers, you know, uh, really okay. great that they did it, but they have some, because of the way, enterprise level uh it works at the school there's like certain security things that they have to do to comply with their like it people of course and it is so miserable on the computers because it's like everything you want to do to be able to play games like is not it friendly it's like oh you need to be able to access all this stuff well, someone could be like maliciously, maliciously using that, and it's hey, like, what? listen, you're preaching to the choir. I was, yeah. I played Overwatch for Stevens University all four years, uh, team captain last year, and we literally had to work almost full teeth trying to get updates going, as well as network connections. Even just basic in-game competitive communication was blocked. I had to do hot swapping in and out of voice chat just so they can hear me every thirty seconds. Nice. Yeah, but um, it, it comes with time, really. So where exactly are the Huskies playing out of? What state? Because I know Thomas College is in Maine. but where uh, We're in Canada, Canada, actually. Canada? East Coast Canada. Oh. Yeah, so Nova Scotia. So if you go from Maine, and you go up, and then you go over to the right, that's Nova Scotia. You can, there, you can, I think you can actually see Maine on a really clear day, maybe with a telescope. <laughs> From yeah. uh, from Nova Scotia across the water, but uh, so they're pretty close actually. It's it's the closest state to us. Then why are we playing on Georgia servers? This is so weird. I don't. They were talking about it at the start. There's something wrong with their pings or something. Yeah, it was, and there was something going on with the internet as well as cellular for everybody. But uh, we don't need to get any more details than that. Hmm. Yeah, we don't have. To, <laughs> Nonetheless, here this pistol round. Uh, how do you think they're going to do this? Do you think they're going to be playing at rush, or they're going to try to wait out their opponents here for either side? Um. Oh well, let's see. Oh, it switched them up again. I'm so used to having my one, two, three, four, five keys for Smew, and then it switched it last time, but it's back this time. Um. I, I feel like Smew does better when they push. I don't know what that's going to be like on ascent, though. They they really have a good um. I'm blanking on the name of Sunset. They have a really good Sunset, like aggressive mm. playbook. Uh, but on Ascent, I'm not so sure that on defense being aggressive works. Yeah. So they'll play it slow. It looks like Thomas College is going to play it slow as well here. That they are. But they have to watch out for the security bot. Just gets it in time, but that does give away your position there. So I think Thomas College is either going to have to commit to a push or they have to double back and go for either site. Any comments on how do you think th this engagement should be going here from the attackers or defenders? We do see that Czar is starting to lurk around through mid here. I'm seeing that. Uh, wait, Czar. Who's Czar? Uh, you Czar Sif? 
Oh, yo, oh, oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, it's his username, Yusuf. Okay, got it. Oh, yeah. Yusuf is that his name? I'm it's, so sorry, yeah, it's Yusuf. Yeah. Sorry, I just like don't even use the usernames half the time. I'm like switching back and forth between. It's like the only people watching go to oh, school. Oh yeah, most. Of uh, it. sorry. Okay, yeah, sorry. Oh, Something just happened there, and I was left. just completely not. So we did not... have to pick up by Dole there in the garden, but now it's going to be Jupiter who also finds one, and they're going to start be making their push towards the point. Don't even get Zar or Yosef, whichever. One to keep a look Good sight control way. there. Oh, and the oh, flank! That's gotta hurt. Emmy's down. We got Memorize running all the way around. I think that's looking like a pistol round win for uh, Thomas College. Uh, most definitely, but I don't think Memorize wants to live this. You get more economy when everyone falls, not just one person staying alive. So I think he should be trying to go for some exit picks here, especially on anyone that's going to be running away. From this uh, explosion. Ooh, oh, there's one. Beautiful shot there against Jupiter. Oh, now he's gonna have shot. to deal with someone on the flank. He either turns and gets shot himself, or he's gonna get caught up behind here. <laughs> I, I feel that like Dole is playing. That, that hurt to oh, watch. Okay, okay Dole. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> a little bit of a flex there. Yeah, most definitely. I, that, just playing with his feet. It's like watching a cat bat around a mouse there. <laughs> and he knows he's on stream doing it. Okay. <laughs> he's something else. That was nasty. Most definitely. Now, this is an interesting setup. Looking at this economy here in buys, it's all bulldogs. Why? <laughs> Well, we're gonna see how it works out. Looking like a, a mid, high mid stack here from uh, from St. Mary's. There's gonna, there's that aggression. So I guess I was wrong. Uh, fully pushing out here silently. They might get behind their entire team. I wouldn't hold if, that out too much. If they miss time this with the Sova, he's looking away. Oh no! Oh, this Jess could be bad. Gonna, this could he doesn't be get very the gun on time though. They get two. That's it's an armor up, but that's sight control for Thomas. Oh yes, but at what cost? Question here. And we're gonna see we're gonna see at least uh we're gonna see a mill and cougar town picking up bulldogs there. Yusuf and Emmy with classics. But they are now pushing with time not on their side. That's correct here, and they're having to clear each corner here. Probably gonna be seeing a rush play. Oh, this could get dangerous. Yusuf gets out! Ooh, but finishes the job for him. Looking for a pick here on Heaven. They get the blind out initially, but Emmy could save it here. That's not looking too hot. Oh, oh, but it is! You know, I feel like I'm always in this catch-22 situation. Oh, oh hold it! Oh, the Damn! Yeah, where you say something, then the exact opposite happens. Always, every single yeah. time. Yeah. Oh my god. Emmy has been, I would say, a real cornerstone for the side of... Uh, for the Huskies here, they just... Yeah, she was going crazy on that last map. Oh, yeah. And I feel like, especially someone that plays these type of Sentinel and Recon ability agents, you don't expect them to play so aggressively mm -hmm. like this. It's definitely, uh... Different. It's different, but it works, so, you know? Oh, yeah, it's most Why fix it if it ain't broke? Exactly. We're gonna see an A A main push. Here. Although that one way is gonna slow him down. Not that Smooth's actually watching it at all. Yeah, unfortunately, there for them. But you will have Omen here on point to help provide some smokes. To help and a knife from Yusuf. They know they're there, so good amount of util there, or a good amount of intel there. Sorry. Just a bit. Swarm grenade. Now gonna be looking for some action swarm though. Out. Throws it out immediately. I'm not sure I would have done that personally myself. I might have gotten a bit more aggressive. They paid it also money. like kind of it kind of locks you into committing sight. Most definitely, I'm expecting Mameras to get big Steel value out of this. Oh, out. he's flashed, but he blinds their whole team. Oh, they were not ready One, for that. There's ready. two. One left. There, there we were through. Was that through the smoke? I don't even know. Nope, it was from a flank with Zar there. Being able to help with the crossfire point out by Town. I will remember. 
So now we're heading into round four here. Both sides have all the economy they need. They're going to be full vine, but it's definitely going to be Thomas College that's not able to really match it up against the defense here, as they don't have full shields. But still kind of... Oh, it's weird. St. Mary's isn't isn't forcing, even though... Like a mill and Emmy sticking with the Bulldogs. Right? Oh, but I mean, there's that aggression. There's that aggressive defense. It works for Smew. It does, but to c counter what you were saying before, why would they? That is a rifled gun, and you get full auto on hip fire with three round bursts aiming down the sight. So it's still that a is good true. gun to have, especially when you're playing thrifts and saves. Plus, if everything goes miserable for them, they just get that. They can just buy the whole team next round. Oh, most definitely. So this is where we're about to see a lot of action on this swing here. It's all going to come down to who peaks first. I think Dole has a Placing big advantage. Uh, Clear there. Oh. Oop. <laughs> advantage out the window. One enemy remaining. Damn, Yusuf picks up three me. there. Oh, yes. And just from a side hit... Thanks to Mamarez, they're able to clean it on up. I, I feel like Thomas College just kind of started to stutter in their movement and got funneled through the middle there. Yeah, and I've. It seems to be what happens when 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 playing against St. Mary's. If I'm not at all biased here, is oh, they it. play fast, and what seems to happen is about halfway through the game, the other team starts to like not realize this. They realize it at the beginning, but they start to understand how to counter it that That's speed fine. and so it uh, the games always seem to follow a pattern of smew plays fast gets a lot of rounds and then the other team kind of starts to catch up and then smew kind of adapts and then it goes from there oh, was that through the wall no okay. He's okay. Dead on sight. oh my heart oh here's gonna be the swing find the first the second looking for the third can he get it yes sir with mf2 aid last one alive is going to be mars and he has a stinger this is not looking good. Got the stinger in a dream. You never know. I mean, that is true in of itself. I've been a big fan of stingers, but then again, I usually play safe and go point blank. Oh, he's, oh, he's flashed. Yeah, that's around for them, Marys. But that does. What do you say, drone? Ready to yeah, that can be a full by round here now for Thomas College. Indeed. But also a full by round for St. Mary's, so it's pretty even. Oh, yes. Even round. Looking like a full stack B push. That it is, but I be a little careful. You've been caught out each time now, and unless you get rid of that recon and put in the corners, you know, things you're grenade. going to be in a world of hurt. Using a lambot. A mill's gone. Oh, no, he doesn't have. Sometimes a mill likes to play the Odin, and he just kind of sits there. <laughs> I would believe it, as it's a it's a bit dazzling. Might be no Cougar to Town push there on B main this time though, so they are going to get up a bit. I wouldn't Ooh, they're going for the that. they're going for the alt play. Yep, that lockdown's gonna help provide some space. But it's all gonna come down to the Ooh. Ah. Nice pick there by Cougar Town. There's a lot going on, but not really Gundam. semblance. This oh, is oh, bad. Oh, oh, oh! Cougar Town saving a mill's life! How? That should not happen. That was crazy. That omen was just looking the wrong way there. Player standing. Now it's going to come down to the end. Next time. Cleans wow, them up for St. Mary's. Whoa, it's so just... Suppressed. I, I couldn't believe what I saw sense. there. Someone detained, gets away alive, and instead it's a trade-up against Thomas here. And this has been four rounds in a row. No, five rounds in a row when wins for the Huskies here. I'm, I'm concerned for Thomas. Oh... That's fair. I mean, we kind of saw something similar last game. Uh, not the same, but I mean, it, it was like, it was it was 5-2 at one point, I think. Oh, yeah. So you never know. They might, uh, well, it looks like they're committing to this heavy A push, and we're only seeing Memoraz and Yusuf here holding it. But they're both back in tree. But T Thomas College just seems to be, I mean, they can't really push hard through that smoke. No, that's true. But they seem to move a little slower on ascent than they were on Sunset. I mean, they, they were moving a little slow on I, I feel like Sunset, just, but it kind of worked. Yeah, I feel like they're just a very cautious team mm -hmm. in comparison. They don't like to push out the way that St. Mary's does. Instead, 
especially on the attack here, comparing the two from Sunset, St. Mary's played to get in your mind. They were playing a lot more mind games, trying to psych out their opponents before committing to a push. Yeah, and I mean, there was there was a few rounds there. Oh, I gotta stop talking when they was seeing a tree push here. Ooh, that's gotta hurt. Oh, Jupiter's blind. Just missing. <laughs> Oh, Memorize tries to get him with the knife. Emmy swings around. Takes out Jupiter there. Um, yeah, there was there was a round there on Sunset where they Thomas College just kind of took a took a while to rotate. I, and then they had to push site fast, which didn't work out because it was covered in cipher traps. But they do seem to be maybe maybe there's more calming going on about what they're gonna do, or they just kind of play it, you know, a little slower. <laughs> and it doesn't seem to be working for them so far, at least not on Ascent. Well, and it's not like they can play aggressively now, especially with everyone full buying this. You're kind of just running into death if you play it carelessly. Mm -hmm. Might be seeing some action and here. Mid. Oh! Ooh. Looking the wrong way there. Yeah, that's going to cost you. Especially when you're trying to retreat, but you were a little too out. Well, Memorize is going to spin it. Gets the first pick. But oh, has look in the wrong way. St. Mary's just does not know where to look on this round. No, Cougar Town's right. holding that corner with the AWP. He gets one. He is in a position that's not He's in a position. Him. Yeah. Oh, just used up all ah. those knives out. That's unfortunate. I planted. Are probably going to be seeing a push up through here. He's very, very quiet making this turn. Oh, there's one right under him. Emmy's coming here. Your tree, she's covered by that smoke. Area. Hits the first pick. He's gonna drop down. Doesn't get the one heaven. I mean, I am up with the Odin. I almost expected here. that. That that's a rough one when you try to jump down with op in hand. It's not favorable at all. Oh, 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 almost had it, almost had it. Oh. That brings us up to a two for, for, see, this could be the start. They could bring it right back to tie. Yeah, no, Wouldn't be the is... first time I've seen something like that. Most definitely. I mean, we have yet to experience the 9-3 curse. You know about it, right? Oh, the Huskies last year at a LAN, Here. they were, they were rolling, doing great. And mm -hmm. because of time, this was a single elimination bracket. And this team that like they could have easily beat, they're up nine three, and then it just it went from nine three to twelve nine. Oh, or thirteen nine. Yeah, it was it was it was tragic. All right, Emil's got the Odin here. What? That's gonna be the Odin. Didn't seem didn't seem to work out. He's been pushed back onto site. Spike oh. down B. But he does get the trade off there at the start. Seeing down. Gets one. one enemy. Gets a second. We see Emmy and Yusuf coming up here for oh. CT. That was very crisp. I can't use that. Always behind him. I got the spike. Yeah. Meanwhile, Cougar Town's slowly coming in. Yeah, they have to be very careful on this engagement. Oh, that was nasty. Oh no. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Pushes them right back into Yusuf. Good play there from the two of them. Gun here. Most definitely there. I I don't know if someone was trying to bait out the other, but that lucky shot there definitely set them up for success. As he was already down to half health. Yeah, that off through the wall was... That was nasty. Cool. But now we are... Let's take a look at this alt economy here. You see that Thomas College has a lot to work with against the defenders here. I am expecting to see some shenanigans afoot here. I don't know if I've seen... If we've seen their omen alt yet. Way. No, most not at all yet. Look. Did they oh, have an no. omen last? Did they get spotted? Uh they got Cougar Town's got knives, so they know he's there or in tree. At least the start, but not really gonna have much of an engagement here going forward. But Smew seems to know there's a bit of a mid push going on and they've got that oh. B main covered with the KJ. Oh, through the wall there from Cougar Town. Yep. Seen a lot of action going on here right now. Could have right an here. engagement here. Cougar Town gets one in tree there. 
Memorize tries for the flank, doesn't work out. Not right now, but Jupiter was able to get the trade off there for it. And now we're going to be seeing Bryce start to actually get aggressive. I don't know about this call here to push up so much. No, I feel like it would be... Maybe it's just looking for a pick? I feel like walking to B is the move here. Oh, uh-oh. They're about to meet each I'm other. I'm swinging it. Emmy, are, are seconds you going to get this? Ah. Uh... Doesn't look. Oh! 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 oh, oh it switches to the knife! It doesn't clear right! <laughs> no! Bryce is gonna get that vandal. Makes it look like he's pushing off it, but he's not. Oh no! Yusuf gets one and he's got Spike. That's gonna call the rest of St. Mary's over to him. Nice flash. Yeah, he has to hit his shot here. Yusuf does get taken down. They need to get the plant now. Can they do it in time? No! Oh no, he's coming back up. Oh, there's. Oh, come timer. on! Finish them with the shorty. Good on him for being able to live out that. I, th I guess that was a wall bang into the shoulder, just missing the head, although it looked like a critical shot there. Man, oh man. The Huskies are something else, I tell ya. Oh boy. Well, you had knives out there from the side of Th Thomas, and uh, in return, you did see Hunter's Fury from Amelius. So. Here's how this stack on A is going to work, especially with all that utility on site. Town was trying for an op push there. Hard pushing up B main, but there's no one over there. It's looking like... Oh. Are they going to get I get all that KJ utility there? But Emmy's countering. KJ ult to hold them off site. I mean, that site is lost. Do they either wait and then re-push it? I mean, I suppose you could, but you really are betting... That's what they're going to do. And if Mamiras does not spot them in time, it will be a very dangerous situation here for the Huskies to deal with. Shadows traveling. Oh, he sees the dart, though. Doesn't put smoke down main. Oh, he doesn't throw the blind. That, that blind would have got their whole team. Most definitely, here. We are seeing trades... Despite the smoke it, setup, it hurts so much to watch all these blind fires with the smoke just barely miss. You should seize one though. Seize him drop! Oh, oh no. Going for the knife? Yeah. no. He wanted that, he wanted that shorty. Oh yeah. They did it before, they'll do it again. That brings us to 9-2. We are hypothetically close to a 9-3 situation. Very, but if they take this next round, last round no in the half. The yeah, season. they're basically guaranteed at that point. Oh yeah. Oh, this is interesting. I'm seeing some guardian gameplay. I'm, gonna, I'm excited for this. Who's going to be the better shot? Is it going to be Dole or will it be Cougar Town if they square up against one another? Do you have your predictions ready? Here. I mean, I have faith in Cougar Town. Uh, oh, but he switched. He's on the operator now. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. I think it's going the Cougar as well. Uh, Cole's honest. pushing up though. As a KJ, he's he's pushing oh, up no. on. Oh, but he's scound. And there's Cougar Town takes him out. Yeah, I, I kind of. Yeah, that he had that. Uh, Cougar Town had that Sova dart on his side, so it didn't. Not not much chance there for. Oh, oh yeah. gets the second one too. Oh, that hurts to see. We're going to be seeing an engagement swinging around here Killed in the tree. Bot. Just has to see if they catch up. Emmy gets the first one. Oh, oh. That's gets it. the second one. He kind of ran down into that. A. Oh, no. All right, is... a 1v4 here for Mars. He's been spotted. He has Hunter's Fury, but he... it's a very dangerous situation. Oh. Gets one. Gets two. <laughs> oh, no. no. Surely St. Mary's will do the smart thing here and just play off that spike. Good thing he's able to get the reload there. Emmy's holding Spike here while Cougar Town's watching for that, uh, no that rotate run. that isn't gonna come. Yep. Emmy's just weaving, dodging and weaving this all. She's gonna get him here, I think. When he, yep, gets yep, him when he comes yep. around the corner. I just Round for St. Mary's. 9 3 curses out of the way. Yeah, it is, but I do say that this is a very defensive sided map. I could be wrong, I've heard a lot of people say it's better for attackers, but personally I think with these angles, the doors, the smoke layouts, I feel it's very defender-sided. 
No, I think you're right. I mean, like... It's like, if you're pushing A, and A main gets smoked off by the defenders, right? Yeah. It's like, yeah, you can still push it from the other angle of tree, but your team is split up so much. So, like... It, yeah, it's def I, th I think I would agree that it's definitely defender-sided. There's just... The different ways to push each site are so split up that it just feels like if one gets locked down, your life is hard, and you could just lock down two at once. But a hard rush be here by Smew. Oh boy. Oh, that was a beautiful headshot. Oh, misses it. And that is total site control for St. Mary's in like 15 seconds. Ow. Oh, Memoraz. Just waiting. Gets Jupiter gets the trade, though, takes him out. He's looking to come through this door. He knows there's two of them there. And having some action up through mid. Oh, he blinded! Last player standing. Er, it was an omen blind, I guess. It was a blind there. But it was a blind and she still takes him out. And then a mill trades for Yusuf. Finish off the round there, taking us to 11. So, I mean, that is that is that St. Mary's speed. I mean, push in fast, get sight control fast. It'll work out. Now, looking like... They're looking like they're thinking about going B again. The way I kind of imagine it, and feel free to laugh at me for it, I imagine they kind of huddle up on each other, like a uh, SWAT team ready to breach a building, and they just put a <laughs> hand on one another's shoulders, like, ready? Go, 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 go! I can see it. I mean, they're all playing side by side, so... Right, right. I don't know, but, uh... Ooh! Cougar Town jumps up and over there with that one. I mean, that is that is total. B is empty. There is no one on B. And they Thomas College is rushing to get that CT control, but for now... They've left the spike oh. in mid. They're, they're just going for kills. <laughs> oh my god. That brings us to match point there for St. Mary's. Thomas College at two match rounds. Point. I think, you know, that is just... It's just... You know, you had uh, you had Dole say high stream, and it's all been downhill since then. Yeah, yeah, they, uh, yeah. Might have they might have might have angered the wrong people. <laughs> I, I think it was more of a like, all right, flush, flush that round away, and just focus up, lock in, get the job done. We'll see what this. Uh... Yeah, no. Once they, I think once they hit their stride, St. Mary's is very hard to counter. I mean, we're gonna see this omen blind. Kurutan's gonna rush in. Oh no. Him and that stinger, unstoppable. Doesn't He's even just going in. Oh, He's just, just going in. What? How? Omen takes him out. He just, it's like, he just knew they were gonna be there. That is map knowledge right there. Oh no. <laughs> spike down, well, attacker spike. spike. So. Well, we could see Thomas College win this one. It's a 3v2, and they just have to sit on spike. Yeah. I, I, I Although don't... Omen, Bammy's a bit far. The real question is, is Emmy going to see him coming around this corner here? Um, coming back. Definitely not. Not the way you expect. Back to. The corner, look no, behind you! No, she saw the smoke! The, she saw the smoke! She sees the gun! Last player oh! oh my word. That's just truly unfortunate. Under Bryce. I, I think Bryce we're... in the... I think he's best sitting around in that smoke. Emmy takes him down. Attackers win. And that's the game. Indeed. I mean, it's two up for St. Mary's in, uh, that's, that's the game. That it is. Well, thanks for joining us here. Yeah, man. Thanks for, uh, casting better than I can. <laughs> hey, man, I'm just going off the cuff. That's all we do at the end of the day. But that was good. That was good. Good that, game. Yep. That's going to be it from us here over at Thomas College and St. Mary's. We thank you all so much for watching, and we'll see you all next time. Bye-bye. In a black top jungle, oh, running with a wild eyed hunger. Everybody try to test ya. No shelter from the rain and the thunder. Fighting in a concrete wasteland. Watch them while they sink like quicksand.